If you slept with your fiance sister, you would remember that. How could you do this? It happened for five minutes, Steve. We weren't even naked. Why did you wait a year to tell your sister? I was scared of ruining her life. You manipulate I everybody. You, you use your tears. I'm not lying. Did you have sex with Jamie? If I'm drunk and I'll be having blackouts. You never said that before. Now, that's a coward's move, what you're doing right now. He's lying to you. I don't know what to believe. Who's going to be the first one to be totally honest? He thinks you're cheating with his little brother. Yes, and he thinks that our daughter is not his. Yes. He thinks that it's his brother. Does, does that give him the right to punch, punch you in the face? I see the way you two look at each other. I'm not sleeping with your brother. Do you put your hands on her? Not physically. I. He's choked me. Let me call me a liar. It hurts when the only man that I've ever loved calls me names. I was wrong. 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 Any chance that you're the father of that little no, girl? No, there's no. Well, we have a DNA test. All right, Cassandra, here's the moment of truth. Two weeks ago, Jamie called her sister Brittany with a shocking confession. She said she had sex with Brittany's fiance. Brittany was devastated, but her fiance denies sleeping with her sister. Take a look. I'm here because I had sex with my sister's fiance, Lewis, and I'm really angry because he's not telling the truth. It happened a year ago. Uh, I went over to the neighbor's house. I was drinking that night. Um, he was telling me he loved me, that um, he wanted me to run away with him. Things just happened from there. We had sex. Two weeks ago, I told her, and um, we were on the phone together. And she said she knew something happened. And I, I couldn't hold it in anymore. I'm really close to my sister. I love her. I just want her to know the truth. And I don't want Lewis to lie anymore. When she confronted him about it, we were on the phone together. He just, he called me a liar. and I'm not lying. She doesn't deserve to live like that. I know he's cheated on her before. I feel horrible inside for what I did. I can't even look at her in the face. I think to myself, how could I have done something to somebody that's been there forever? <laughs> Over a person who doesn't even care about her, I don't think. Because <laughs> he's told me numerous times he doesn't want to be with my sister that he wants to be with me, he wants to run away with me. He's so in love with me, he has been since the first day he met me. I didn't have feelings for him at all, at all. Not like that. My sister and him have a child together. They've been together for five years. My sister and my niece mean a lot to me. She's my little sister. I can't even fathom myself why I would do something like that to her. Brittany, that's your sister on the tape. Do you believe what she's saying? No, I don't believe anything. Because that's just who she is. She's that kind of person. She manipulates everybody, and she uses her tears and everything to get under you and get you to accept everything she, that she's saying, her apologies. So she's making this whole thing up. I mean, I don't, honestly, I don't know what to believe. That's why I came here, but I'm he, gonna guess, the person, I'm, and I'm doing this, I probably shouldn't, right off the bat, he slept with her. You're gonna guess? That's what I'm guessing. Well, I mean, for him to come wrong. here... I could be wrong, but here's your sister, right? Yeah. And you guys had a pretty good relationship before this... Yeah, we were always close. Super always. close, right? Yeah. So what motivation is there to say, yeah, I slept with your man? Well, because she has always said that she envies me for things that I do and, like, the strong person that I am. And she's envious of your boyfriend, maybe? Well, she was the one who introduced us. That's why I don't understand, like... If you introduced me when I was 15 and he was 29, but then at the same time, okay, all these rumors up? that she was the one <laughs> trying to get my mom to press charges. How long have you been together? Five years. Oh, okay, so yeah, we'll let that slide under there for a bit. Um, so you, you were a young girl, you met this guy and you really liked him a lot. Mm -hmm. And then how soon after meeting him did you get pregnant? About six or seven months later, that's when I got pregnant oh, with my daughter. Okay. And how's your relationship with your boyfriend? It's good. It's good? Yeah. I mean, like, we, 
like the last couple months have like kind of let everything from the past be the past and we kind of just Why, tried to forget about it. Yeah, like he cheated stuff. on me in the past one time that he told me about. That was four years ago when I was pregnant. Um, but you moved on and, yeah. and the relationships have been good. Yeah. You got a beautiful little girl. Yeah. And you want to stay with him. Well, it's... Here's the question. It depends. When your sister calls you and tells you this, right? Mm -hmm. um, he denied it. And if it is true, then I'm leaving. Now, your sister said that you, on the tape, that you had some su suspicions. Yeah, about a year ago, I went on a, a trip for a few days. And uh, when I came back, everything was, like, not right. Like, it wasn't on his part. It was on her part. Um, she would, like, follow him around, try to make conversations with him. Uh, like, little things like that. And I noticed, but I didn't say anything to anybody until somebody else brought it to my attention. And that's how I knew that I wasn't just seeing things or being, like, suspicious for nothing. And how did she explain that behavior? And she cried and said, oh, I would never do that to you. You're my sister. I love you. Just like she's doing now. Like, and that's one thing she has to realize. No matter how many times she apologizes or cries, I'm never going to forgive her whether she's lying or telling the now, truth. Now, these are... And I don't want her in my life. This is a situation that, if she did it, I think it would probably be hard for you to be close to your sister, right? I would never speak to her again. You would never speak to her again. But even if she didn't do it, it's pretty horrible because she's making up this pretty bad lie right. that could break you and the father of your child up. Right. All right, well, your sister's here. Let's bring her out. <clears throat> How could you do this? You Wait think minute. that by saying you're sorry, it's going to be all right? No, I don't. Yeah, you do. That's I what you do to you everybody. You manipulate I everybody. You, you use your truth, tears. Brittany. You use your tears and your apologies he to get other you. people. He I don't care. You. Jamie, it doesn't matter. You say you care so much and you, I do. you feel bad for lying. Why did you wait a year? Oh, oh I was scared. Oh, you're scared of what? I to ruin your life. Well, why would you do it? I don't expect you to ever forgive me. I will never forgive That's you. That's fine. You will never Just see know. my face. Unless Just it's in public and I it's by mistake. You. Just know I love you, and that's why I told you. Yeah. I don't want you with yeah. him. He's a he's cheated on you before. He told me he don't want to be with you. He told me he wants to run away with me. He's told me on numerous occasions how much he loves me. Why'd you wait a year to tell your sister? Because I was scared. Scared of what? Scared of but how you weren't, she'd but react. You, but, you, but you weren't scared to take your clothes off and sleep with him. I knew she was happy. <laughs> It happened for five minutes, Steve. We weren't even naked. Did you have sex with Jamie? If I'm drunk and I'll be having blackouts. You never said that before! He thinks you're cheating with his little brother. Yes, and he thinks that our daughter is not his. He thinks that it's his brother. Does, does that give him the right to punch you in the face? It hurts when the only man that I've ever loved calls me names. I was wrong! Why did you wait a year to tell your sister? I was scared of ruining her life. Did you have sex with Jamie? If I'm drunk and I'll be having blackouts. You never said that before! It happened for five minutes, Steve. We weren't even naked. I walked <laughs> next door. It happened for five minutes. I stopped it. I didn't feel right about it. How does it, how does it even start? I don't... I don't know. Listen, you I don't keep understand. saying it. I don't know. I don't know. I don't. I don't even fathom myself how. But I did here, it. here, listen. People have affairs or they cheat they, all the time, right? But this here's you know your own sister, which right. that's pretty appalling, right? You are the aunt to her child. You're you're sleeping with the father. I mean, come on. And you you keep saying, well, I don't know why I did it. All of a sudden, clothes are off or clothes are on. But you're having sex Things with them. Right. And, and then during the course of it, you say, oh, I feel bad. I thought to myself, how am I doing this? So I stopped it. And what did he say when you stopped it? He didn't say anything. I left. As soon <laughs> as I was done, I left. See, man, that story, you shouldn't be telling that to anybody because nobody's, you need to go backstage and figure out a better story. And that's <laughs> Wait, wait. I wouldn't come here. Hold on, hold on. Let's let's say that what you're saying is true. Right. But her her man, her fiance, is sleeping with you. You stop, and he doesn't say anything and just what, let you walk out. He didn't say a word like, "Come on, let's finish. Come on, let's keep doing it." No, I don't. 
don't even remember, honestly, Steve. I was drunk. Oh, jeez. Listen, it was over a year ago. Why did you wait a year to tell your sister? I was scared of ruining her life. So why would you so do why, it why in I the tell first her place? Now? Why tell her now? Because I was sick of holding that secret in. You got to know that your sister would probably break up with this guy if you slept with him. Right. So you let your sister waste another year of her life being with the guy that slept with her sister. Yeah. And so you don't care about that. So a year goes by, huh, it's August already? Oh, time to tell my sister. It's not something, I don't want to hurt my How sister. How many times have I confronted you about it? Do you have feelings for her fiance? No. Uh, it, it, not did, you guys, all. did you guys ever talk about it afterwards? Like, hey, we had sex. No. No. No, he's asked me to meet up with him places. He's called and me. And what do you say? I tell him no. I, I avoid the situation. I even and that's avoid the same going thing that he to says, her house. That she calls when she knows I'm at work and tells no, him that she her, wants to see him. I call my sister's like, phone. They're both switching this. So you only had, had sex with him one time. One time. One time. Um, man, I just, I'm finding you so hard to believe. I wouldn't come here and lie and take a lie detector. Nobody does. Well, I'm, I'm not lying. And the lie detector will come to that right? It's out now. He's lying. I'm not. I'm okay, telling you he the truth. He can lie. He can lie all he wants because regardless, I'm not going to stay with him if he's okay. lying. Okay, well, that, that's what I want for you. I just want you and the baby to be happy. Yeah, and that's what everybody says. And that's going to make you, her why happy. Why are you so much pressuring the point? you slept with her man and now she's going to break up with him. That's I make just you want happy. her to be happy, and then I know no, she's that's not what everybody be happy thinks. That why would you want me to leave him so bad? Boyfriend, Lewis, let's bring Lewis up. Hey, you know one you're time. lying. You're you're one know, time. You know, one time. You know, yeah, one time. Uh -huh. You know that's you're lying. That's why you lying. try to give me a in front of everybody. No, on you're a liar. I'm a liar. You're a liar. I'm a liar. That's all you ever have. Yeah, I know. I'm a liar. You cheated on my sister how many times? Are you, you're, you're How many times? How many times? How many times? What you mean at? What you mean at, Jamie? Who you came with? How many uh, times? How, how many what? How many times did you cheat uh, on my sister? I cheated on her one time, and she knows one about time? it. One time? One time? Did you tell me you uh, were in love with me, Lou? Did you tell me that? No, I didn't. No? No, I didn't. She says, and I don't know if you heard or not, that um, somehow you managed to have sexual intercourse with your clothes on. Um, <laughs> at some point, she said, oh, man, I shouldn't be doing this. How am I doing this? And she left, and you didn't even say a word, and that was the end of that. Yeah. Did you have sex with your sister-in-law? Yeah, I could remember your... not, but I could remember her trying to give me a yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold on. That's say that lot. again. Hold That's on. Be quiet. Sh yeah, I could remember from sleeping with her, no, but I remember her trying to give me That's not. That's not saying, no, I didn't sleep with her. Cause I really don't know if I'm drunk and I'll be having blackouts, but I'm, I'm not gonna say I did it or not. Oh, so now you don't know. No. How am I supposed to know? Now, you never said that before. He denied it. How he denied it to, to the fullest. He but denied now you it don't know. over there but when I asked you know. about it, but now you don't know. Hey, remember what I said the first two seconds we were sitting down? Yeah. I guess I'm right. <laughs> If you slept with your fiance sister, you would remember that. Now, that's a coward's move, what you're doing right now. He's lying to you. Who's going to be the first one to be totally honest? Any chance that you're the father of that little no, girl? There's, no. Well, we have a DNA test. All right, Cassandra, there's the moment of truth. If you slept with your fiance sister, you would remember that. Now, that's a coward's move, what you're doing right now. He's lying to you. Who's going to be the first one to be totally honest? Now, let's play a game. Who's going to be the first one to be totally honest? You're saying, you know, you were having sex, and then you stopped, and you had your clothes on, and you left, and he didn't say anything. He's saying, I don't remember. Which, if you slept with your fiance sister, you would remember that. Any feelings for her? No, hell no. Any attraction? I ain't no feeling for no. Hell Did no. you ever tell her you love her? No. You ever want to no run away with her? Why would I want to run away with her? She sleeps with everybody. <laughs> Sounds like you are too. You don't. All right. You cheated on her before, right? Yeah. And so and. What made you say, I'm never going to cheat on her again? <laughs> what, 
what he just said, I don't know why I don't cheat on her. He probably doesn't. Well, then why are you with him? Okay, um, your father, mm -hmm. you're 34 years old. When do you grow up, man? <laughs> when, do, when do you stop playing games like this? When do you stop getting drunk? I'm not hearing anything while you're with this guy. He's blacking out, sleeping with your sister, Be doesn't he's, remember. It's not like he beats on me or anything. He's, I mean, he's good to me. He's a good father. No, he's, he's there for us. He's not loyal to he, you. He took he's care. He's not loyal to you. There was one time that I know about. That's why I came here. Because if this is true, I'm not staying with him. Do you really him. need that lie detector result to say that this story is true? Mm -hmm. And is the bar set so low as I'm with him because he doesn't beat me? No. I mean, I mean, he took care of me too. He worked and took care of me. No, and, you okay, worked. Tell Brad. me something. Why you, you love him? Now I work. You took care of him the whole time you guys were together. No, I didn't. You did know it. the family. You so know your everybody says the whole, says the whole that time you that should that not be taking care of a 34-year-old man. Be Who says that? Care care of him. You should not be taking care of a 30-year-old man. How should take care of me, Jamie? Because I work. How should take care of me, Jamie? I'll say this. I myself, Jamie, I, I myself right, would not let a 29-year-old man date my 15-year-old daughter. That, that is like no even part of why we're here. Jamie, yeah. um, I think you're telling the truth. My hand's not on fire right now, so I think you're telling the truth. Um, but I do think you're lying about why you slept with them. Every, when you sleep with somebody, Everybody knows why you're sleeping. There's different reasons. You have feelings for them. You're turned on. Uh, revenge. You know, there's, there's reasons why you sleep with somebody. The, I don't know why I slept with that person, that doesn't cut it with anybody. You know, that just doesn't. It's a, it, it's a shame, though, and I'll say this before I read the results, because really, when it comes down to it at the end of the day, all you really have is family. Um, you know. That's what she's always said. Blood is thicker than water. So uh, why would you do that to somebody that you love? I'm sorry. Just like I mean, uh, every, everybody on, else you've loved, you you hurt, right? No. You have hurt everybody you've loved. Hold, hold, yes, you have. In okay. certain ways, yeah. Yes, okay. you have. Hold on. As you go through life, you lose friends, you mm -hmm. lose spouses. You know, things happen. People come and go out of your life. But at the end of the day, like in my life, I have my parents, I have my sisters, my brother. And if I can't count on them not to screw me over, then I can't count on anybody. You know what I mean? <laughs> Five minutes of non-orgasmic sex to throw it away. Your sister's, you know. I regret it. It's one of my biggest regrets in my life. OK. All right, Jamie took a lie detector test, and you were asked, do you have romantic feelings for your sister's boyfriend, Louis? You answer no, you told the truth. <laughs> Did you have sexual intercourse with your sister's boyfriend, Louis? You answered yes. Do you, do you want to say anything before I read this? No. Really? OK. See, because me, if somebody offered me that chance, I'd be confessing my ass off. <laughs> He's choked me, let me call me a liar. It hurts when the only man that I've ever loved calls me names. That I was wrong. Do you, no. do you, do you want to say anything before I read this? No. Really? OK. See, because me, if somebody offered me that chance, I'd be confessing my ass off. <laughs> Did you have sexual intercourse with your sister's boyfriend, Lewis, you answered yes. She told the truth. Oh my God! <laughs> you, you don't remember? You don't remember nothing, right? Well, we'll find but out. But she's telling the truth. Hold on, we'll find out, Brittany. Does Lewis tell you that yeah, he is so. in love with you? She answered yes. She told the truth. <laughs> But I wanted you to know, you deserve Why to know. would you wait this 
long and waste my time. I'm sorry. You wasted my I'm time. Sorry. At on least him. I told you. For what? At least I told For you. For what? He's lying to you. At least I told you. All well, right. You can keep lying, Jamie. I really don't care because it doesn't matter because you won't be able to lie to me no more. Good. I'm not staying with him. Good. He can, he can lie to the next bitch. That's what he can lie to. Do you, no. you, you want to say anything before I read this? No. Really? Okay. See, because me, if somebody offered me that chance, I'd be confessing my ass off. <laughs> We asked you, did you have sexual intercourse with your girlfriend's sister, Jamie? He said yes. He confessed. You said yes? Well, yes, you're standing up here saying no. He tried. Um, you never said that. Why is that coming out now? How many chances have you had? And he was also asked, um, do you have romantic feelings toward your girlfriend's sister, Jamie? Do you have romantic feelings? He answered no. He didn't tell the truth. Did you tell your girlfriend's sister, Jamie, that you are in love with her? He answered no, and he did not tell the truth. Oh, get the oh. out of here. Get the out of here. Wow. Is that you such I, a leap of faith? No. I told you I no, was going to come. You blacked out when you said it. I told it. you. No, there ain't no way, yo. But you know what they say? Hey, the truth comes out when you're drunk, right? Yeah, it comes out the when you're drunk. Comes out I'm never, when you're drunk. I'm never, I'm never, I'm Okay. That's a coward's move, what you're doing right That's now. That's right, I'll be a coward. Okay. You want to be a coward? Be a coward. Yeah, yeah. You're going to lose. It doesn't hurt, y'all. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I was in the smoke wait, two weeks wait, ago when he was calling wait. me. I love right? this. I, 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 I absolutely love it. Here's a guy that the heat's on, right? The heat's on, and he abandons his child's mother on stage. Oh, he walks off. He leaves you here all, all by yourself. Oh, my, my woman's back there? I'm out, I'm out, I'm out. Okay, have fun walking down the hallway. Now, the truth of it is, she'll always be your sister. Mm -hmm. She made this horrible mistake. Is there any way you could say, you know what, I'm not gonna talk to you for a while. Mm. I hate your guts for doing this, yeah. but you are my sister. Yeah. We're gonna patch this up somewhere. No, because you she, talk to her. You manipulate everybody. You use your tears and your apologies to get to everybody, and it doesn't work with me. I That's don't what cry you know, you know tears. that for a fact. I don't yes, cry. Yes, you do, I'm Jamie. I'm crying because I hurt you. So why and would I'm you do sorry. it then if you knew it was gonna I'm hurt me? Sorry. You don't make any sense, and you don't know why you did it. Jamie, I really don't care I'm why. Sorry. I don't care that it happened. Okay. Because well, I know what I'm doing, well, and I'm cutting now. you and him completely out of my life. You can have, you can see her. It's, it's really terrible what you did to your own I sister. Know. As gentle as I can, because you destroyed your relationship with your sister, get off my stage. <laughs> um, it seems like maybe you yourself have put on some blinders with your boyfriend, um, not looking at the obvious facts. And the fact that I said, well, how come you never cheated on her again? He couldn't even get an answer. So if a man can't contribute anything to your life. My mom taught me that. Don't depend on nobody. There you go. She did a depend good job. Yourself. Good luck to you, okay? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. He thinks you're cheating with his little brother. Yes, and he thinks that our daughter is not his. He thinks that it's his brother. Any chance that you're the father of that little no, girl? No, there's no. Well, we have a DNA test. All right, Cassandra, there's the moment of truth. He thinks you're cheating with his little brother. Yes, and he thinks that our daughter is not his. He thinks that it's his brother. Cassandra is desperate to prove she's not having sex with her husband's little brother. The accusations are tearing their family apart, and now the paternity of their two-year-old is in question. Take a look. I think my brother is having an affair with my wife. He told me she cheated on me with another person. So then it started making me think a little bit. He's accusing me of looking at her ass and 
It calls them to shove me. I catch Cowan and Cassie looking at each other with like a glare in their eye, like they got feelings for one another, like there's a passionate feeling in between them. He came to me for help, and then right after he turned around and started pointing fingers at me, saying that, that I could be the father of uh, the kid. And that's supposed to be my brother, and they're going to do stuff behind my back. They flirt. If he goes in another room, she'll go in another room with him. Um, thinks that like uh, she's always sneaking from him, his room to my room. He's just, I don't know, my brother's crazy. He's obsessed with her. The thought of my wife sleeping with my brother makes me sick. It makes me angry. I feel angry, upset, like uh, just a whole bunch of different uh, emotions. If I find out that kid is not mine today, I want nothing to do with her. I want all legal visitations. And if that kid is Colin, I don't ever want to see my brother again. All right, Cassandra, that's your husband and uh, brother-in-law on the tape. What is going on? I'm here today because I'm fed up with my husband constantly, constantly accusing me. He does not give up. He thinks I'm having an affair with his brother. He denies the paternity of our daughter. He's even gone as far as to put his hands on me before. He's slapped me a couple times. He's choked me. He's pushed me, grabbed why, me by my and arm. Why did he slap you and do those things? Because I'm a whore. That's what he says, I'm a whore, I'm not good for anything. When I stick up for myself and I say I'm not a whore, and that's not true, and I'll yell back and he'll just, yes, you are, slap me, call me a liar, things like that. Um, he sets booby traps for me. He checks my shoes. He puts peanut butter on the bottom of my shoes. He has put things on door handles. He's locked me into our bedroom at night with a scarf. Um, even at the hotel this morning, he woke up asking me where I went. I said, no where's. He said the lock was different. I never touched the lock. I didn't, he was the last person to leave the room. It's all in his head. He, we have been high school sweethearts, on and off dating since I was in fifth grade. Um, I love Greg with all my heart. I would never do anything to hurt him at all. Then when I was two months pregnant, I found out that he cheated on me. He promised me it would never happen again. I found messages to other females on our one year wedding anniversary. I went and I, I went and I confided in with somebody else and I ended up having sex with him. I felt horrible afterwards. I felt like a whore. At first I thought... No, this is after you were married? Yeah, we were already married and everything. And I told him the next day and he went ballistic, which I thought that he didn't care about me anymore. I didn't even think he was going to care. It broke my heart so bad. And ever since then, he has constantly called me names, putting me down in front of other people. He punched me in the face once in the car. He's choked me. He's grabbed. And why do you t tolerate him abusing you like that? I because I love him and I know that he really, really thinks that I'm doing stuff and I'm really not. I just wish that he could see that. So, uh, if he uh, knew I that mean, I really uh, wasn't listen, doing anything. Listen, I see anything. a young woman on my stage in emotional turmoil and I know this might be a case of I got married way too young. If you really love somebody, you would never, ever put your hands on that person. <laughs> I mean, even the fact that you cheated on him, does that give him the right to punch you in the face? No, no. I guess I just feel guilty every time, and I feel I, like he really, really... I can hear really, him mumbling really, back there. He's got a big problem with his line of questioning. I feel I, like I, he I really, really, really truly believes that I'm cheating on him. I think, th he I think that he now. really, and really believes tape, that. It seems like he thinks you're cheating with his little brother. Yes, and he thinks that our daughter is not his. Who does he think it he is? He thinks that it's his brother. His brother. Did you ever sleep with his little brother? I never, ever slept with his brother. You're 20 years old, right? Yes. When you hit that next, you know, rough patch in the road, do you think he's going to be able to be a husband where he doesn't put you down in front of other people? I think that he really does love me deep down. I think he just really <laughs> honestly believes this stuff in I his head. I don't think you've been dating enough men to realize what real love is. <laughs> Let's bring out your husband, Greg. This is about me and my brother. About I'm not you sleeping, sleeping with your brother. No, that's not I don't what I think. sleep I see with signs anybody. when he's following you through the house. You when think you, guys are you looking see signs? Like There's 
I no might be losing my mind. Chemistry is all in your head. I have never put my hands on you fighting like I that. The only way I got ever, away was it was when anything. you blocked me from leaving the house, man. I don't want to have the booby trap my house because I'm thinking I my wife is leaving. I don't know you do. Y'all laugh. It's not funny, man. It's crazy. The one you love, you think is sneaking. Ah, right, you feel me? It's cool. I respect that. Yeah. I really don't. You just said he booby traps his own house. It's crazy. It is. It is. You're right. Do you put your hands on her? Not physically. I. It hurts when the only man that I've ever loved calls me names. I was wrong. Any chance that you're the father of that little no, girl? There's, no. Well, we have a DNA test. All right, Cassandra. There's the moment of truth. Do you put your hands on her? Not physically. I. It hurts when the only man that I've ever loved calls me names. I was wrong. I gotta say, the crazier the story, the more I love to do it. No, I hate okay? It. And when I hear things of like, I'm putting booby traps in my own house, why are you doing that? Because I wanna be certain. I don't wanna accuse this girl and make her have a tears want her in her to eyes be like loyal. that. You want her to be loyal. But yes. I hear you don't want her sleeping with I've other been people. Loyal for Just a like year. she doesn't want you sleeping with and other people. And I haven't people. since we got married, man. But you did cheat on her. Yes, before we got married. And oh, she so as long as you're not married, no, it's no, okay. No, that's totally wrong. I was wrong, yes. Okay. I made my so fault. you did the same mistake she did? Yes. Is she booby trapping you? No. Well, it why not? Takes... Is she giving you but punches she took to the time, face? Though, you know what Is I mean? she punching you in the face? She's keeping me from leaving with my thing. She's, she's, she's holding the door. She's holding you. Yeah, she is. She's biting me. She's holding me. I do block the door. I have to. I cannot oh, get out. Get off my stage! <laughs> oh, man. You blocked the door? Because How could you do that? Because it makes me I'm, I'm, so I'm mad I'm that joking. he actually thinks these things and he's really going to take out and end our marriage over something that's not true. I know it's wrong to stand in his way, but it's wrong for him to leave on false things. How you see your wife, how emotionally torn up she is, crying on my stage. I cry How's that every make you feel? single day, and he tells me it makes him mad that I'm depressed, but I don't try to be depressed, but it hurts when the only man that I've ever loved calls me names and thinks I'm having sex with somebody else calls it's me because I'm hearing wolf. rumors everywhere, Cassie. I see Our the way you two look at rumors. each other, the bond my brother has with my daughter when they're together. And it's not like no a brother bond. bond. It's like they, I don't know, it's like perfect. Like could I see pictures a, of him and could her. Could it be an uncle niece bond? Yeah. Um, I just want you to be loyal. How old is your little brother? My little brother's 18. 18, let's bring him up. Colin. Um, crazy story, but now he's all psychotic about you sleeping with his wife. Yeah, no, I... Drives me crazy. I can't believe you. Drives me crazy me for that, man. That's, I don't know, um, I just how was your relationship with your brother growing up? It was good. Like I loved him. You know what I mean? I always looked out for him. Like I love him. And I love his family. Right. You know what and I mean? you I'll, love your niece. Yeah, I love my niece too. I right. Never Any chance like that. that you're the father of that little no, girl? No, there's definitely no positive. No. No chance. No chance. Did you ever sleep all. with her? No. Ever I wouldn't kiss her? Nope. Grab I wouldn't even think about that. No. I used to walk her to work. You kidding me? I you walked. You walked her to work. Yeah. What's and what's wrong with that? He, Nothing. he was just looking out for me so I didn't have to walk alone. That's my brother's wife, you know what I mean? I got her back just no, as no, much I as just... I got my brother's. And... I've been there since day one. I have fell for this girl a hundred times in my life and stuff like that. We finally Do you put did your hands hit. on her? When... Do you put your hands on her? Not physically. I... <laughs> I don't know what I'm saying, man. How, how the only the time way, I put my put hands on her is picking wait, her up and moving like her this, out of my right? way. Like right. this? No. 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 <laughs> okay, uh, well, we have a DNA test. Let's find out if you're the daddy. Let's find out. <laughs> Greg?
Okay, uh, well, we have a DNA test. Let's find out if you're the daddy. Let's find out. <laughs> Greg, you are the father. Okay. No, it's I'm not worried. even done. I want you to hear the lie detector results. Then you can be sorry. Be sorry for the past nine months that you have made me feel like I'm nothing, that you've made me cry by myself and haven't even yes, given I have me a Yes, people tell me how they see you doing things all the time. I don't care I what be people persistent. say. I be... People right, say yeah. a lot about you, We're and I don't it. listen. Yeah. All right, Cassandra, here's the moment of truth. You were asked, do you have romantic feelings for Greg's brother, Colin. You replied no, and the results for that question is, you told the truth. <laughs> Did you have sexual intercourse with Colin around the time you got pregnant with your daughter? You answered no, she I'm told sorry, the right. truth. Oh. Okay, this is me. Okay, Have I'm you sorry. ever had sexual physical contact with Greg's brother Colin? You answer no. The results for that question is you told the truth. Just one more question. Other than the one time Greg knows about while in a relationship with Greg, have you ever cheated on him? She answered no. And the results for that question is, she told the truth. Anything you want to say? That I'm sorry, and if I need to go to marriage counseling to make this work between you, I will. Uh, there's nothing I can do to take back all the mean things, the demeaning ways I've been to you, the controlling. <laughs> but if you're willing to give me a second try, I'm willing to prove to you that I'll be the husband that you've seen in before, that you want to be with. I'll do anything for you, Cassandra. Can you go back to being that guy a year and a half ago? No, I can go back and be better. You can go back and be better. That's my wife. So she blessed me with a beautiful child. Right. I hope it works out. If for some reason he goes back to being his old, you know, new way instead of going back to the old way, call us. We'll have you back on. We'll knock some sense into him. Let's go.